What's happening guys back at you with another video and in this video I'm going to be reacting to the new Venom Let There Be Carnage trailer. So we finally got the trailer. They finally dropped it after waiting so long for it. Uh, I believe the movie is supposed to be coming out uh, in August or September I think around there that time. Uh, so we finally got a trailer for it. Finally been waiting for a trailer for this movie uh, for Venom Let There Be Carnage. So let's get to it. There's chickens everywhere and stuff. Hey, he's going crazy in the kitchen. Man, he looks horrible. Eddie Brock does. <laughs> Damn. Such a mix. Excuse <laughs> me. <laughs> Good evening, Eddie. Hey, Mrs. Chen. Good evening, Venom. Hi, Mrs. Chen. He says hi. <laughs> this is funny. She's like, you see him, I guess. I mean, no one with it. Much, Eddie. Oh, you can also. Oh, Ravencroft. Is that supposed to be Shriek? Oh. Oh. The chocolate delivery hasn't arrived yet. We had a deal. What's gonna happen? You gonna stop protecting me? I am happy to eat, Mrs. Chen. No, no, you cannot eat, Mrs. Chen. She's like, what? <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> He's like, I'd be happy to eat Mr. Chin. <laughs> That's funny. So, <laughs> so it seems like she's pretty uh, normalized with, uh, I mean, she knows about Venom since the first movie, you know. Uh, so she seems pretty normalized with it. Him being around and all that. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. <laughs> he said that he forgot the chocolate or chocolate delivery. He hasn't came in yet. And he said, I'd be happy to eat her. <laughs> She's like, what? All right. So I got to say, um, not too bad of a trailer, really. Um, uh, I guess one thing I like about it is that they really didn't get too much away. You know, it's kind of a good thing. Uh, sometimes trailers get too much away sometimes, uh, which isn't always a good thing. Uh, so this one didn't really give too much away, you know, we already know we're getting Carnage, I guess, I'm guessing that's Shriek, but I'm not 100% sure. So yeah, that could possibly be Shriek in there, at least I'm like, from what I'm assuming, you know, they had her trapped, she was actually, uh, trapped in, uh, I believe she was trapped in Ravencroft, I think. Um, but you know, she had, it showed her like, kind of screaming out, at least I had to like, you know, the scream out, or you know, Shriek, you know, um... So, it'll be interesting to see what her character is. If she is actually Streak, how her character actually comes into play in this movie. Um, one thing will be interesting is, uh, she probably, I mean, like, you know, I'm just assuming she probably will be bad. Uh, maybe even team up with Carnage. I don't know. Maybe see. Uh, but she does have one of the symbiote's weaknesses, you know, with the Shriek or the Scream, you know. And they're very highly sensitive to that. You know, so we'll see how that comes into play in the movie. Um, 
So, like, Carnage basically is, like, the offspring of Venom, for those of y'all that might not know. So, he's basically, you know, an offspring of Venom. Um, so, you know, Cletus Cassidy, who was played by Woody Harrelson, which I think Woody Harrelson will do a good job with this role. Like, he really does a good, just a good job with his roles, and I think he could pull this role off, playing uh, Cletus Cassidy. Um, so that'll be interesting to see how he does with this role. I'm definitely excited to see that. And they, uh, definitely fixed the hair, you know, the, the in credit scene of, uh, the first Venom movie. He had like that kind of wig that looked goofy and all that stuff, you know, but they actually, you know, it looks like they did a better job of you know, getting it fixed and all that. He looks a little bit better, uh, now. So it'll be interesting to see how that, but I'm definitely interested in seeing how he plays the role of Cletus Cassidy. It'll definitely be interesting to see that. Um... You know, like like I was saying, they didn't really get too much away in this trailer, which is, you know, pretty good. Could leave some surprises for the movie, uh, which is always good. You know, you need that kind of factor in when you're watching the movie. So it definitely will uh, be good for that if they don't get too much away in trailers. Um, definitely excited for it, you know, after uh, it being delayed and all that stuff, like a year already, I think. Or by the time it comes out, it would have been delayed a year already, I think. Because I think it was supposed to come out last summer. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, uh, so, you know, of course, uh, with everything going on and all the movies are getting delayed and all that stuff, uh, but definitely excited for it to finally release and hopefully, hopefully it stays with that release date, I believe it comes out in August or September. So hopefully it stays with that release date and it doesn't get delayed again. Like a lot of movies have been getting delayed. Like, uh, I don't know if it's true, but I heard Morbius might get pushed back again. Uh, so, or delayed, you know, so hopefully that's not true. Hopefully we, Morbius sticks with its release day. I think it was supposed to originally come out in January and that movie <laughs> was literally supposed to come out last year also. And now it's already pushed back to January. So hopefully it at least stays with that release date and doesn't get pushed back anymore. Hopefully, uh, cause it definitely will be excited to see that Morbius movie. Um, I don't know. I don't have too much else to say about this trailer, you know, uh, was it overwhelming, really, so, uh, you know, we got our first reveal of Carnage, which, uh, looks okay, you know, he looks okay, doesn't look too bad, uh, we'll see how he is in the movie, you know, after everything gets done with it, uh, so, you know, definitely excited for his movie, and hopefully it sticks with the release date of, uh, it's supposed to come out in August or September, something like that, you know, so hopefully it stays with that, and it doesn't get delayed anymore, but, um, yeah, you know, not too much else to say about it. I like how they're continuing with the, uh, buddy relationship between Venom and Eddie Brock. Uh, it seems like in this movie, like they did in the first one, they're kind of that buddy kind of relationship. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, you know, it's kind of funny to see that too. Like, in the, especially in the beginning of the trailer where he's cooking and making, making a mess in the kitchen. And just Eddie just looking all horrible and stuff, you know, it looks bad and stuff. So, it looks like they're going to keep that in this movie, so it would be cool to see that, and, you know, some funny parts and stuff like that. With that, uh, but honestly, uh, not really too much other stuff I noticed in the trailer too much, so maybe some surprises uh, left for the movie, which would be good, so we'll definitely be checking that out. I know they were saying, like, uh, it wasn't... Like, this movie is not really part of the MCU. Like, you know, we're probably not going to get Spider-Man in this movie uh, like people want or anything like that. But they said maybe eventually, maybe eventually, we can have some crossovers or something like that. Or saying they're trying to make some new deals and stuff. So maybe eventually we'll get some MCU crossovers with uh, the MCU and the Sunny. I forgot what they're calling it. They had, like, a specific name for it. It's like the Sunny... Marvel Universe character, I don't know, something like that, something like, <laughs> I don't remember the exact acronym or name for it, but like, you know, the Sony, uh, Marvel Characters Universe, whatever it's called, you know, I forgot the actual specific acronym or, you know, the specific name for it, you know, but they said eventually maybe we could get some, um, we could get some, um, crossovers, you know, that'll be interesting to see. I didn't remember that Andy Serkis actually directed Venom. Let There Be Carnage, he directed this one. I actually forgot about that. Like, I knew he did, but I forgot about it for a second. I just remembered about it. He's actually directing it. So it'll be interesting to see how uh, he does it, because he's pretty good. Uh, he's pretty good director, you know, and pretty good actor himself. So uh, be interesting. I'm definitely excited for this movie. be interesting to see 
how it goes down. Um, so hopefully the release date stays the same and we'll get it in September or August, whenever it comes out, you know, so hopefully it stays, but, um, let me know your comments down below or let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. Definitely like to hear from y'all, but that's going to do for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Remember, if you want to be part of team legendary, all you got to do is subscribe and turn notifications on. So, you know, I post another video. Hope y'all have an awesome day and remember be legendary.